Howdy everyone. I'm at a torn down house spot. Um, originally my brother and I were going to do a road or a sidewalk tear out but uh, they're, they already filled in. Uh, but uh, at this spot I found my first keeper. It's a wheat penny. Cool. Well I went back to the excavation spot. Uh, figured I'd hunt this some more. I didn't have too much luck at that torn down house spot. Just got a 1924 wheat. Howdy everyone. I'm back here in the woods. I just found a couple of weeks a little bit ago. Um, man, is this loaded with poison ivy. I'm going to have to try to take care of that when I get home. But uh, not very bright out here in the woods. I just found a key. Uh, there's the, uh, the two wheats I found so far. That old Tootsie toy seen better days. Howdy everyone. Uh, back home now. Uh, actually, uh, I've been in and out since I left the woods. Um, came home and I went and I cashed a check and put that in the bank. And, and uh, uh, en route, I know happened to notice that there was some sidewalk tear out. So um, these are the two wheats that I got there at, uh, in the woods. Uh, I think that one's a 41D, and this one here is a 34. And they're both in pretty rough shape. Um, but at this, that's the only two coins I got in that woods. Uh, Here's what I got from them tear outs, sidewalk tear outs. Uh, good for 10 cents in trade and a 1906 Indian, which I thought was pretty cool. This one here I kind of thought, oh, it's got to be a two cent piece because it's so encrusted. I had to use electrolysis on it because it was bad. And then it, on the other side it says McNally's. Indians are actually in better shape than them we. <laughs> which I thought was kind of strange, but hey, it's that dirt. But this, the McNally's, good for 10 cents in trade, that was underneath the sidewalk itself. Uh, this Indian, I think it slid down from from one of the yards that the sidewalk was right up against. And I think that's where that Indian came from. But, uh, yeah, that... that Good for ten cents. That was a good, a good three, four inches under where the sidewalk used to be. Thought that was pretty cool.